Hey gamers, it's Grind This Game here, back with some oxygen not included. The launch upgrade preview. And last episode, I had a lot of trouble finding this right here. It was staring me in the face. I, I went back and I looked at the footage that I recorded, and I went over this, like, passed by it many times, and it was right there, right in front of my face. But there it is. Thought I was looking for the gas reservoir. So I actually don't think I'm going to actually end up using it now that I found it. What I want to do, I got a bit of a plan here. Oh, look at this. So cute. Anyway. Uh, I think I'm going to make a, a room just for chlorine that's not going to be here. I'm going to make a little room maybe right in here. So I'm going to have to have, gonna have to make some tiles here. I'm probably going to do a, a liquid lock. I want to be able to grow food kind of in this in the ceiling here. So I think I have to leave some tiles. I'll probably leave some natural tiles, but I can probably dig these ones up. I kind of want this to be four high, or at least at least three high, maybe four. So I think I'm going to do this. Yeah, and we can extend it if we need it, and then dig, dig this out. But I also want a liquid lock in here. So I gotta plan that out as well. Probably do something. Something like that. Yeah, something like that. We're just gonna use regular water. We actually have a decent amount of water, so it should be safe to do this time. And I hit the wrong button. I think I wanted Oki. There we go. Speed things up. We're going to take on some more dupes as well. But yeah, I want this chlorine room with a natural ceiling. So we can actually grow some salt. What are these things? Salt, uh... Dasha salt vines. I want to grow those in here. On the ceiling. In a chlorine room. So we'll have to pump everything out. Make a vacuum. And then any chlorine that we get from in this area we're gonna pump over but we need a vacuum first so I should probably prepare that as well we'll just do a gas pump and we'll just pump everything out which is gonna be mainly oxygen so let's get that ready I think igneous rock should be fine I think that can go just like that uh, maybe we'll do a little Something like that, for now. And this will need power, so let's do that as well. I got enough power using this coal and hydrogen over here, so I think I'll just steal from that power line. We don't need to filter or anything. So this will be a dedicated chlorine room, and we could probably even store food in here, and it'll kill all the germs if there's any germs in there. I think I'll also put this uh, pitcher pump back here for local water. That's where there was some ice in here before. I should mop this tiny little tile here. So they don't get wet feet all the time right there. So we'll let them build build that away. We gotta, we gotta build the floor here before we allow water to go in there. So these because the chlorine level just kind of moved itself up, these aren't growing anymore. That one's that one's not growing either. Yeah, so we're gonna have to put it put those seeds in here, and then bring over a little critter, one of these little pips, and we'll get the pip to hopefully grow some seeds in here. We'll see how that goes. Got the floor in. We'll let them kind of finish everything before we. Ah, we can put some water in there. Should be safe. Not gonna use polluted water like last time. Enable auto bottle, we need that. So yeah, we got room to grow here. No pun intended. Okay, there we go, we got some water in there already. I like to have a full tile in the bottom and a little bit of water on top just so it maintains the seal. 
I guess one of these was probably enough. Since the water was so close, yeah, I can probably take this out. Deconstruct that. We don't need it. Okay, how much do we got in there? 500. We'll keep adding more water until we got about 400 kilograms on that top tile right here. And we're sucking air out. Oh, we're actually sucking some chlorine out of there. Oh well, that's okay. Now I also want pips in here. So we're going to do a critter drop off. Where should we do that? Right... I don't know, maybe right here? Kind of out of power. We're struggling. Okay, that's 60 watts. Uh, we're doing quite a bit of stuff right here. And I realized that this this oxygen here, it's getting hot and it's kind of losing a lot of its heat along here. So it's heating up this area. So I'm going to use insulated gas pipes once I have them. Let's just see. That's a radiant gas pipe. I need insulated gas pipes, which are probably right there. Do that next in terms of our research. Might actually need some more coal power. One's not keeping up. Too much stuff going on here. We got lots of oxygen pressure, so I'm going to turn this one pump off just for now. That'll stop everything here, so the filter should stop draining power, I think. Yeah. I don't think they use power when they're... Let's just see. Power produced, power consumed... No, we're good. There goes that battery. Okay, good. Oh, I always forget to keep an eye on these water locks and they overflow. So that's probably good. We got 999 and we want maybe 400 on the top. And then we can stop this. And we want some pips in here. We'll do pip priority 7. They might actually try to plant this mealwood, but there's no actually there's no pl place to plant it on the bottom. So hopefully they'll plant it up here. We actually probably want a door here. Just to keep the pip inside here. We could probably dig this out a bit more. Okay, like I said, I always get distracted. 200 kilograms, oh, we're almost there. One more bottle should do it. Yeah, that's probably good once that's drained. Yeah, that's probably fine. Let's turn this off. We should have, we should have a vacuum in here shortly. And let's go round up some pips. Uh, let's see here. We got Wrangle. Capture. Let's capture priority 8 on this little guy. And one should be enough, but I'm, I'm going to grab another one. And hopefully that's the only drop-off point at the moment. I think it is. Oh, we got stuff. Let's get our free stuff. A Slickster. Or Rust. Uh, we got a Night Owl. I think I'm going to get... Oh, should we get here? Ari. Yeah, let's get another. Let's get another dupe. And let's give Ari a job. Ari loves to do research and medicals. I guess we'll do medical. We don't really need a medicine thing right now, but it's pretty, pretty cheap in terms of morale. Okay, we got our little pip in there. Now we need seeds, so we're going to put a container in here. Oh, I guess I could have put it right there. We'll put some seeds in here, and he should grab them and try to plant them. But we also have to dig this up here. I think we can just 
do it like that. Grab that. Yeah, we're getting close to a vacuum in here. And I want to keep exploring as well. Oh, everything is out of power here. Are we out of coal? And yeah, we got 11 tons of coal. Let's make that priority eight. So they actually bring some coal in here. Coal. We like to burn coal. It's the lifeblood of our colony. That pip animation when they go into the containers. I love it. I think I'm thinking of sealing up this little room here as well. Uh, I'll have to figure out how I'm going to do that though. I could put an airlock here and then seal the bottom and have a different way around. Something like that maybe? Just a little small room in here. And then we can, I don't know, it'll just be more self-contained. We can probably turn this pump back on. Actually, once we have a vacuum in here, we can turn this pump off, or back on. Okay, now the seeds. We want a salt plant seed, priority seven. Then these guys should just automatically start planting stuff. On the ceiling, I hope. And do we have our insulated pipe yet? I think we do. Yeah, insulated pipe. Okay, we're, igneous rock's pretty good for insulated pipe. So all along here, we can draw over here, draw, draw over top. And they should just insulate it. And we'll insulate it all the way up to about here. And then everything else will just get... Oh, maybe I'll take it a bit, a bit farther, further, farther. Farther is the word I want. Right up to... Maybe there. And this should actually be radiant pipe in this loop here. And I could probably extend the loop over more into the cold zone here. I also want to get into all the salt stuff here, this episode. We can probably start doing that. Okay, let's go straight down here. I want to even this water level out so it makes just a tiny pool of water instead of this big one, because these guys are drowning in here. Don't need that ladder. Yeah, we'll go down like that. We'll get a little bit of water out here. That might mess things up because this water might flow out, but we'll see how it goes. Maybe take that out like that. I want this base to have tons of wild plants. That's the idea. Oh, this is all done. We should probably just get in there and get that. What does what does Nosh Sprout need? Minus twenty five to zero. It's gonna get too warm in here for those soon. Uh, actually, it'll take a while. What's over, what's wrong over here? Too warm. Seven degrees down here. Hmm. I think Abyss Light is still transmitting heat. Bit of a bug. Okay, let's also go down here, low priority. Just get in here, get that free food. Same with this, I guess. You can probably cut across here like that. We're getting rust as we do this. We've got 50 tons of rust, so we're gonna be good for oxygen for quite a while. And do we have our vacuum yet? Uh, do we have a vacuum? We have salt. Picked up two salt. What's 
going on there? Okay, they should take the seeds out of here. We're almost at a vacuum. And we should probably prepare the pipe that's going to go in there. I'm actually going to use insulated. Actually, it doesn't matter because it's going to end up here anyway. But let's just use insulated from up to here. Right to there, I guess. This is where the chlorine is going to go. We've got a vacuum here, but not here yet. Okay, are they taking the seeds out of here? They should be. We could just kick the seeds out of there. I think I'll do that. See if they pick them up. I do want to get nice bathrooms in at some point. I don't think we don't got any research going right now, so let's just do all this jetpack stuff over here. Everyone's busy doing stuff. Got some, uh, what do we got here? Super hard digging. They're busy doing research, so but later on they'll be digging, so let's do that. Zirkit, you can do some more digging, I think. Good time. Still got lots of cleaning to do. There's crap all over the place. Let's put dirt in here. Dirt. Yeah, stick that in there. The decor in the base is terrible. Quite terrible. Got a genius sculpture. I could put more sculptures in here. So I'm going to take this deodorizer out. Move it over slightly. Put it on the edge here, maybe. And should we move the washroom over one? I think I'll move this washroom over here. And then we can put some statues in between, and that'll brighten that room up a bit. So we'll put the... Put it in first. Let's use granite. We'll make a really nice materialed outhouse. Then take this one out, put two statues in there, and that should kind of help the decor of the bathroom a bit. Okay, we never got a pip here. I'm going to put a pip in here as well. Pips are our new friends. Grab this little guy. Oh, there's a bunch of seeds here. Actually, I'll leave him there. And we'll try to get one up there. They don't seem to be planting anything. Hmm. Maybe they're broken. They were working last time. For sure. Let's grab this guy. Yeah, pick up the seeds, you little buggers. Do your duty. Do your job. They still work? Enjoy foraging for seeds. Yeah, there's seeds right here. Well, maybe they can't... Maybe they have to dig it up? I think they just pick it up. Okay, do we have a full vacuum? Not quite. Still a little tiny bit of gas in here. Even It says it's a... A vacuum but it didn't quite work usually this once it gets to this state usually everything is gone but we'll let it kind of finish oh that's so weird the pump's not running but those little micrograms of gas just disappeared strange okay this pump can go I'm gonna deconstruct it don't need it anymore A baby. Little baby. 
Ooh, bookshelf. Uh, sure, why not? <laughs> Just let him run around the base. He eats polluted dirt and rock piles. Oh, he might actually go into our bathroom and... What is he doing? Oh, he's sleeping. Look at that. I've never seen that animation. He's blowing bubbles. <laughs> That's so weird. Okay, this bathroom we are going to get rid of. I gotta spiffy up this bathroom as well. I mean bedroom. And up here, we're gonna add another statue. Another bed. Another mist table. Can we do paintings? Oh, we don't have any reed fiber. Maybe they changed the paintings. Let's just double check. Paintings require fiber. We can get fiber from Drekos if we start a Dreco farm, I think. First, what kind of statue do I want in here? I guess all we could make is one one of these, so we'll put two of those in there. And we should have our vacuum in here. Yep, like I said. And they're not doing anything with the seeds. I'm going to put the seeds back in. See if that makes a difference. Because they were going into containers earlier. Grabbing seeds. And we can get that chlorine in there now. So we'll cut this pipe. Make sure to set buildings. Actually, it's set to gas pipes. Never mind. We'll cut that pipe. In fact, all of this can go. And then we can hook this up here. And turn the pump back on. I mean, we should have a nice little chlorine room here. Okay, that is not there, but it is there. Okay, there we go. How did the oxygen get... Oh, the oxygen actually got pretty low during that little exercise. Pretty low. In fact, the food is pretty low now, too, because I'm not really growing it anymore. These guys are not planting seeds like they should be. We might have to just put the food back here. We'll leave a few and see if they do their job. I know they can only plant into dirt apparently or soft soils. So that could be some of the issue. I don't need this little tile here anymore. That can go. Make sure I'm only deconstructing buildings. And this is 50 degrees. If I send them in there, are they going to burn? Probably. We were making our way over this way as well to see if we could get in here. And I hit the wrong button. Okay, let's try to... Try to go in here. Priority 6. And we'll... I guess we'll ladder across. Because I don't want them to get frozen. Yeah, we'll just let them walk on the ladder. And we'll try to let this drain out. We don't, I don't want them freezing. There's some food up in here that's kind of messed up now. But this is free water. We could, we could use this. For good purposes. There's only chlorine in here. That's not so good. Need some oxygen up here for them to, for them to breathe. We've got algae now, so I'm going to put an algae terrain up here. Right. Actually, maybe down here. Just to get some oxygen in there. And whenever I make these, I should also be putting in a deodorizer because... We we're just going to let the polluted water sit and gas off polluted oxygen, and then the deodorizer can turn it into nice oxygen. we got lots of oxygen in here. It's not really doing us any good. 
Let us open this up a bit. Okay, how's this? It's coming over at 37 and leaving at 14. That's perfect. And this area over here will get warmer and warmer over time, but it'll take a long time to warm up this whole thing, I think. Or a crab. Okay. Let's, uh, let's even this all out here. Weed seed. I think I can drop this down one level. But a nice even surface where there's not too much water. Yeah, we'll take this all down. Down to here. They're gonna get all salty. They're gonna have to have a clean shower after this. Now, is that going to be too much water? I think that'll all even out nicely. I hope. Let's just see. It should be one tile of water. Yeah, that should work. Oh yeah, they're growing now. But the seeds don't naturally plant themselves anymore. So we're going to have to get a pip over here to do some work. If they're actually doing their job. Oh, we need a deodorizer right here. How much polluted water do we have? 357 kilograms. Okay. Yeah, let's put a deodorizer right here. Yeah, these pips aren't doing anything. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe they did some update where these guys don't plant seeds anymore. He just went in the container, but he didn't really do anything. Hmm. They will plant seeds if they find a suitable area with enough space. Yeah, there should be enough space in here. Until then, let's just plant a few uh, food. Farm tile. We'll put a couple salt vines in here. Oh, I just, I think I just saw the bug here. So they picked up the seeds and put them in the container. They were invisible, I think. Yeah, I think the pip took them out and they kind of went into the, into the ether. Might be a bug with those. Let's turn that off. Okay, how are we doing? How are we doing? Oxygen is uh, not great. We need some more airflow. Put an airflow tile there. Maybe a couple here. Upgrade some skills. Lindsay. Oh, you're a good cook. But we'll do carrying first. How's the decor in here now? Uh, lots of debris. Gotta fix that up. I think what I'll do for that is just build some containers here that'll be sweep only. And then we'll just sweep up the core base. That'll make them happier. Okay, we got the seeds here. Yeah, there's something broken with them. So these guys need sand for domestic growth. Quite a bit, but not like a crazy amount. Let's put a few more in. That one's the wrong way. So these should consume the chlorine, I think. Consuming chlorine, 16 grams per second. And how much is this thing making? The rust oxidizer. Emitting chlorine, 30 grams per second. Okay, so we should be able to keep up here. In theory. Get 
Okay, these are going to be sweep only. And we're going to do agricultural. We'll do consumable soil. We'll do sand. What else do we got here? We'll do lumber. Do all metal ore. What's under miscellaneous? Abyssalite, sure. Organic, we have to be careful with. Algae's okay. Eggshell's okay. Raw mineral of all sorts is fine. Fine metal should be fine. And we'll copy that to here. And then I'm going to do a sweep task. That's mopping. Sweep priority five, sure. Just kind of in the core of the base here. All that crap can go. Oh, we got an oxyfern seed. I think this is the only way to get oxyfern seed, so I'm gonna do it. Quick learner, yeah, we're gonna get that. And over time, hopefully they'll clean up all this crap. Got to replant these mealwood because our food is kind of 53 nosh beans. Hmm. Our food is kind of low. Get those back in there. I think all our dirty water is gone, so we could be making lice loaf with the water. 50 kilograms and we get a little bit more food out of it. Is that worth it? I don't think so. We'll conserve our water. Let's make this an eight. I kind of want to see what's in here. And we'll make our way across here. See what's at the edge. Oh, we got a wheeze wart. Okay, let's just see. What do we need here? Wild growth doesn't need anything, but it only does its 25% of its cooling, I guess. Oh, fertilization phosphorite. That's not too bad. We've got 23 tons of this stuff. Oh yeah, so we'll use this in the base. That's fine. That's pretty cheap and actually not too bad. Oh, they're freezing. They're in the frozen water. Let's dig this out a little bit. So they don't have to freeze their butts off. I want to conserve as much of this stuff as sleet weed as I can. So we should actually go up here a little bit. Yeah, they're going to get hypothermia in here. So this is all starting to melt. We want to keep this as cool as possible. There's a pretty big ice biome here. So we'll try to drain the water into one place and then have a nice dry journey down. So I might actually get them to dig down here a bit. They're going to get cold. But it kind of has to be done. So then all the cold... Actually, we could drain it through here. But that should be fine for now. Take this out and then work our way down here. See what we got. Got some oxygen here, a little bit, a tiny bit, that's good. Make sure those are not, make sure they're priority seven so they actually get done. Made a mess. Oh no, two toilets out of order. Uh, you're peeing in the water lock, that's perfect. Mokun, you've done a wonderful, a wonderful job. Good job. That's actually, that's fine. You can pee in the water lock all you want. I think we need another bathroom. Oh yeah, we took on all these dupes. Okay, let's sort, let's uh, spread them out a bit. Ari on shift two. We got three, three and two. I guess that's as balanced as we're going to get.
What have they stored away here? Dirt and lumber. Okay, let's take a look at the desalinator. Refinement. This thing takes in either salt water or brine, five kilograms per second. Uses 480 watts, which is quite a bit. And we got, it gives off 460, 4,650 grams if it's salt water, less if it's brine. Makes quite a bit of heat. But that's gonna be a source of water for us. And a source of salt. We need a pip in here to do some do some work. Do a critter drop off. We'll get a pip over there. Hopefully he doesn't drown. He might actually drown in there. Yeah, I'm not sure how that's gonna work out. Maybe. I kind of want to seal the base up as well. Let's do some airlocks here. We're going to do an airlock here. That can be open. Should probably seal down here at some point. That's sealed. No, it's not. Look at this. What have I done? What have I done? What is the meaning of that? Seal that up. There's already oxygen in there a little bit. Oh, actually, oxygen is looking pretty low. It's all trapped here. Actually, it's not trapped. <laughs> we can fix this. We have the technology to draw a straight line. Okay, that can go there. And really what I should do here to get an even nice natural split is to put a bridge in here. So I want the bridge to go like this. Something like that. And then we'll get an even split. 50-50. It just, it just flows a bit nicer when you do it with a bridge like that. See how that works. Yep, 50-50. I should probably do the sweeping a bit higher priority in the bedrooms. Let's do priority eight, just, just to get that cleaned up. <laughs> what is this crab doing? I'm gonna call it a crab, because it's pretty much a crab. I think we need more oxygen in the base. And probably we need to stop vending it out into space. Probably get away with this being a, a sealed room. I don't know. We need more of a bedroom here. So I'm actually going to have to build some tiles here. Unless we raised it, we could raise it up, but we're going to do that instead. Okay, they cleaned the bedroom up really quick when I did it that way, so next, next highest priority I think will be the mess hall and the bathrooms. Actually, I don't want to sweep up the bathroom because I want that stuff to gas off. Actually, the crab belongs in here. This pokey shell belongs over here. So temporarily, I'm gonna. Is he gonna come over? Here, I don't think he'll go in there unless we drop him off. I think I'll finally clear this off here. <laughs> it's been sitting like that for a long time. Okay, could have drop off. Let's see if we can get that poke shell in there. Pokey shell. This tree is growing even though it's kind of trapped. I want to dig that out. <laughs> OK, 
Okay, we got some salt vine growing. Consuming that chlorine, good. What is that? Polluted oxygen. Oh, what? I thought I was filtering... Oh, I'm filtering hydrogen. Okay, I don't really need to filter the hydrogen anymore because there's none in here. So we're going to get rid of... Actually, we might put an electrolyzer in here later. But probably not. So really... Hmm... I definitely want polluted, don't want polluted oxygen going in there, so I'm going to cut this off until I fix this issue. It's mostly chlorine in here. In fact, do we need, need any more chlorine in there? I don't think we do. I think that's probably good. Pressure's good. No air should get out, so that's probably fine, actually. Now this filter is actually doing nothing at this point. Hydrogen. Let's get rid of it. It's a waste. Unless we make it... Chlorine... It's fine if there's chlorine in here. Yeah, let's just get rid of this filter. Deconstruct that. I'm gonna get rid of all this here. Actually, I'll leave the pipe. We'll clean it up a little bit. And then we can go straight like that into there. Oh, we got a bit of chlorine. <laughs> okay, if I set this up right. Oxygen. Yeah, everything else. We might actually get chlorine in here, so everything else... Uh, I probably should have left that second filter. Hmm. I think everything else will just chuck back in. Chuck back in the room for now. Oh, I really need my second filter. Because this is actually going to get consumed. Oh, I'm an idiot. Should have left that filter. Okay. Uh, let's put it back. <laughs> so the second filter will do... Now we're out of space. Uh, second filter will do just chlorine. Where should I stick this? Uh, I think right here should be fine. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so everything else and then chlorine. This will work. Everything else there. Chl chlorine will come out, go that way. And then everything else will go right there. Should just be CO2 and polluted oxygen and stuff. And then power. There we go. Priority 8. Not the container. Container. Actually, container for bleach don't give me 7. That's fine. Okay. Actually, there's a noticeable pressure drop in the chlorine here. Like, it's really consuming it. Okay. Oh, someone got sick here. Hypothermia? How's my oxygen? Kind of low. Okay, I need to seal this bottom room here. So I think we can take this ladder out here. Is there a germ somewhere? Are they getting pollen? Oh, our food's all dirty. Look at that. Lice loaf. Germs. Food poisoning. Nasty. Let's store the food in here. <laughs> in the chlorine. Mm, I kind of don't want to end the end of the hallway, so I'll probably move these guys over. Just lost our pressure. Let's select chlorine here. Missing. Oh, there's a bug here. Rock gas. Propane. Chlorine. There we go. 
Perfect. That'll repressurize. There we go. I think I'll move these over one. Jeez. Oh, I want to be upside down though. Copy does not copy the direction. How are we doing for sand? Filtration 22, 22 tons. We're good. So food. We're going to move all the food into the chlorine. So it'll kill all those germs. And we'll get rid of these too. good. This thing is max gas pressure. We actually need two pumps in here to make this go properly. To go max, you know, kind of max output. So I'm going to move this airlock right to there. Then we can fit another pump in. This bomb lily can go. It's not going to grow in here. That's, that can stay, I guess. And we got to seal this bottom. In fact, I'm going to insulate it. No, we'll leave it. We'll just do granite right, right across like that. And they can still get down here. That's all good. Okay, this airlock can go. You can tell I don't have a plan. I just wing it. That's why everything is nice and messy. My previous base is much more planned. These ones, not so much. I want this to be very organic. Very organic looking. So now that we have this sealed, that chlorine should get stuck in here. Near the bottom of the room and get kind of sucked out. Yeah, that'll work. Emitting oxygen 570 and the pump can do... 500, I think. So we can put another pump in. That would be a bit wasteful, actually. These pumps can do... Does it tell us right here? 500 grams per second. And this thing is giving off 570... 600. We actually could just do with a mini pump. Uh, which I don't have yet. Okay, I'll put a second pump and we'll only run it if we need to. We'll do some automation on it. Do we have enough power, power on this line? No. Okay, forget that. <laughs> Let's check our, our reports as well. Oxygen generation. Versus uh, consumption. We're producing more than we're consuming. That's good. What about the day before? Not so much. <laughs> and algae, we have not so much algae. Got some free food. Oh, hatchlings. Let's take those. Our hatch farm is kind of a failure because we don't have a floor in here. So they're burying themselves, so they're not really getting groomed or anything. So I'm thinking I might have to put a proper floor in here for these guys. Or we could just keep them wild. Down here. If we keep them wild, they're not going to make mu make much coal. But they'll make some, so we'll do a critter feeder down here. We don't even need a feeder because there's dirt on the ground, but... Put those hatch eggs in. We had a bunch of hatches in here. Oh, they're all buried. So they only come out at night, I guess. They're not going to be very productive. Hmm. Maybe I'll just put a floor in. That means we lose our tree. Kind of didn't want to do this, but... Uh, let's just do a floor. 
granite. Yeah, we want that hatch farm to be producing. Yeah, we lose some natural plants, but at least the hatches will start doing some work for us. And they just fell down. <laughs> that was kind of inevitable. Let's pick them back up. I think he's in here somewhere. Yeah, he's under there. I think some fell down here too. Maybe. Where are those little buggers? Oh, I didn't mean to pick him up. Oh well. <laughs> okay, now we got a hatch. And once they build that, they should not be able to burrow down anymore. Actually, he's gonna he's probably gonna fall through. Don't you dare. Yeah, he's gonna... Oh, he can bury himself here. Jeez, little bugger. Little bugger. I'm gonna add some more airflow in here. I might actually do airflow... Oh, that's fine right there. I kind of don't want to pick this up. But there's no CO2 there, so it's not going to really grow. So we'll, we'll dig this up. We'll put some airflow right here. Along this whole column. Don't really need that there. I didn't really leave much room for a fire pole, so I'm going to have to integrate that somewhere. <laughs> How's our lettuce doing? Oh. oh yeah, there's a volcano up right here. I don't think it's going to be able to give off anything. I hope. Got lots of salt we could grab in here. How much salt do I have? Actually, not much. Let's go grab some salt. Salt and sand. And we can get to the edge here. Oh, we got another ice biome in here. So we'll just keep going here, get that salt. Lots of food in here. Free delicious food. Okay, something is drowning. Oh, the building is flooded. Okay, we're going to have to put a tile here. Hmm. Yeah, we'll put a tile there for it to sit on. Take that up. And we need a door at the top so the pips don't get out. I think the pips actually going to drown in here. We'll see how it goes. We got one water weed growing at least. Take a pip in here. Now I think they, there's pips being dropped off somewhere else, so we gotta make sure that is not the case. Are we all in low pressure here again? Hmm. We're really not making chlorine fast enough. Let's release this chlorine. I'm gonna release this for me. I'll try. Whoa! Did he just make an egg? I think he just made an egg. I don't want him to get out, so I'm gonna put a door there. I 
can probably move a few of these hatches up. I want to keep some wild ones. But we'll grab that one. Unreachable. Let's make a ladder right here. This salt vine we could probably grab. Okay, we gotta we gotta wrangle a pip here. No one's done any jobs over here, so let's just wrangle one of these here. Grab him. It's getting nice and hot in here. Maybe stick a Weez Ward in here or something. The research area is warm. Actually, let's do more research. Okay, what else do we have up here? I kind of want to go over this way. Low priority. Get over that way. And they never got in here because I didn't dig that out. Okay, fine. We're going to go like that. That should work. Let's do seven on those, seven on that. Actually, a decent amount of stuff over here. Kind of want to get... Kind of want to get down here, though. So we're going to do that, I think. We're going to get some ice here as well. Which is always good. Ooh. Nasty oxygen. There, let's uh let's clean that up. Don't like seeing disgusting air like that. I think we need some more dupes. We're at eight. Oh, we got a little bit of stress here. Circuits. Circuits is stressed. Out of chlorine gas, look at that. Hmm. I'm gonna uproot one of these. We have enough. We do have some water, so I could use an electrolyzer as well. But actually, we're back to normal. That should be fine. Got some jobs. Got to keep on top of that. Don't want to stress them out too much with this. These requirements. Uh. Red. Let's do... Kind of want exosuit training, but we'll hold off. Cocoon. Actually, everyone's kind of close to the, the limit here. Oh, Meep, you can do something else. Farming, sure. Not that we're doing any farming. And Ari. Could always use a digger. Oh yeah, and I was gonna drop that pokey shell guy. I have a feeling if we pick him up, he's gonna get angry. He's a crab after all. Can I get you. He's hungry and happy. Oh, did that work? Did he get angry? I don't know, I got him. Or, or, I 
think Gauntlets is a better deal. These hatch eggs never got moved. We should stick those up here with like a hatch egg box. And our food should be germ free now. Yeah, it is. Good. Nice to see. I haven't found a natural gas geyser yet. Oh, this got revealed. That's good. Any secret hidden geysers in here? I don't think so. Got more stuff down here. I think we could go down. Let's just let's just strip mine some of this good stuff out here. Get all this coal. Do that maybe. Oh, well, they never went in here. Actually, I don't want this chlorine to come out of here. Oh, well, they can't even breathe in here. We gotta get some. We gotta get an algae terrarium in here as well. I can actually breathe right at the bottom, maybe. Actually, that's not going to be the bottom for long. <laughs> Stick it there. Then we'll mine this down. We'll get all that coal. See what we got down here. Where's the bottom? Uh, the bottom is... Where is the bottom? I don't know. <laughs> Way down there. <laughs> Everyone is suffocating. What? Where did all the food go? Oh, there's food. Jeez, you scared me, Zirkits. Go eat some food. This sounds really nasty in here. Is this guy eating the poop? He's happy. He should be. How much food does he eat? 140 kilograms per cycle. That's a lot of poop. That's a lot of poop. Let's close this door so we can get out. Can he get out? He's not leaving. What is that nasty sound? I think that's this stuff. I think it's the polluted dirt. They should have just called it poop. They're not fooling anyone. Let's clean this air. Do a low priority dig there. That one meal we plant, that can go. That's fine. Oh, the pip's gonna burn. Or drown. It's getting kind of hot in here. Uh, this whole area, I want to... You know what we can do here? We can do some temp shift plate made out of ice. Maybe right there. Try to cool down that area. I think the only thing that's using water right now is the research. Yep. Yeah, there's no place for the seeds to go. Oh, what just happened there? What the heck? I thought I cancelled the pickup. I think something just... No harvest pending. I think something... <laughs> just broke there. Uh... Starvation, come on, what's going on? Go eat! You dummy. Dupes refusing to eat.
Yeah, that sounds nasty. That guy will eat it all up, though. And what do they poop out? <laughs> oh, yeah, lime. Sand. Okay. They molt. Confined. Glum. Hm. Oh, he's stuck in the door. Damn. <laughs> Try that again. Let him out. <laughs> Okay, he's, he's been freed. Back to eating poop. Let's get our eggs in here. Hatch egg. That sounds so bad. It sounds so bad I might have to sweep it up. Eat. Keep eating. Well, he'll make a baby. And we'll get more poop eating capacity. I've messed something up here. I don't know what the heck I did. I cancelled something. Let's try to harvest. Okay, there it's fixed. Good. Food's actually getting a little bit low, so I'm going to make all these six. And we're down to two toilets again. Yikes. Okay, do I have enough? I think I have enough water to make a bathroom, but... There goes the ice. That's good. I just... I'm a little bit worried about the heat being produced from the whole bathroom setup. So maybe I'll do it off to the side where it's not going to cook the base. Or I could do up, do it up in this cold area. Really close to the water. And then they can come over here to go to the bathroom. That could work. Yeah, that could work. I kind of want it in a dead-end hallway, though. So maybe in here we could do it. But that's... Then they have to run through the bedroom every time. Maybe in here? Yeah, we could do it in here. Can we do four high? One, two, three, not quite. Wouldn't be able to fit the showers in. Hmm. I'll have to plan out where I'm gonna do the nice bathrooms. Do some more research. Don't really need the rocket stuff yet. Let's do glass blowing. Make sure we have enough rust. 52 tons of rust. A decent amount of salt, but it's easy to go mine more. So we're good for oxygen for a while. Let's try to get... We're at the edge here. Okay, good. There's nothing really in here except for ice. We could use it, but... I think I'll probably just strip mine this out. I don't like when that happens. We'll just do that. I might have to build some granite tiles, because it's just so slow for them to run around. Later on we're going to get tubes, so that might work. Okay, let's check decor, see if it improved at all. Not really. <laughs> Oh, we got a we got a morb. We'll leave him because he's gonna make free oxygen. Actually, he's gonna make slime lung, isn't he? But the slime lung will compete with the food poisoning in the air. I might just leave him. But we don't have crap. We don't have a uh, 
deodorizer in here. Let's get that back really fast. Forgot to put that back. We definitely need that because the air in here is putrid. And we should probably put a few more of them around. And we don't have enough airflow here, so that can go like that. Like that. Ah, uh, we don't need that millwood there. Take that out. And this should be priority seven, fertilizer. Oh, we got a wart seed. Beautiful. Let's plant that right away, right beside this this hot stuff. Power pot right there. Probably prepare another statue and bedroom here. Or bed. Oh, I messed that up. Try that again. Did they get over in the cold here yet? They did. Okay, let's mop that. That is not the key I wanted. Mop that, mop that. We're looking for uh, anti-entropy thermonullifier as well. Hopefully there's one down in here. We got free wild food here, so I'm gonna grab that. This'll cause a cave-in. So I might go in from the top here and then down. Oh, they're mopping forever, we don't want that. Now, do we want to get this Weezwort or just leave him? I think we'll leave him in here, keep this area cool. But we can plant one in the base here. Right here. Uh, it doesn't... Where did our seed go? So these... Can we plant these? What do we plant these in now? They used to go in here. I'm not really sure where we plant them now. Uh, maybe in a food? Actually, that's... Maybe it's... Considered food now? I don't know. Yeah, we should be able to plant them. We used to be able to plant them. Are they considered food now? Let's just see. These work. Domestic growth. Flower pots. Can be grown in flower pots. Okay, that's a bug. Yeah, that's a bug. Something new for me to report. But we're going to wrap things up here. Uh, I think we've done enough. We're going to run out of time here. Uh, next episode, what are we going to do? I don't know. We're going to continue the research. Continue the exploring. Maybe build a nice bathroom, because this is kind of disgusting. Yeah, we'll put the nice bathroom up here somewhere. But, uh, as always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you all next time.